If you're one of those students that hates the process of completing the square and you just want something fast and easy to follow, then that's exactly what I'm gonna do in this video. However, you're, it's not gonna make any sense and it's gonna be really easy to forget if you don't understand the process of completing the square. So make sure you know that first. But once you know that, let's go through the tips to be able to complete the square quick, fast, and easy. All we're simply gonna do is we're going to create our binomial squared and we know it's going to be parentheses x, we're gonna keep the same term here. So if that's a subtraction, that's a subtraction. If it's addition, you keep it as addition. To find your term inside this parentheses, you're simply just gonna take your b, which is the coefficient of your linear term, and divide it by two. Four divided by two is just going to be a two. That is going to be your binomial squared. Now, whatever you add inside of this, now you're going to subtract here, you're gonna take your b divided by two and square it. You always go ahead and add it directly inside the parentheses with the same sign, and then you're always going to subtract the, this term divided by two squared. So four divided by two is two, two squared is going to be a four, and then you still have your c plus one. Now I can just combine these terms, y equals x minus two, quantity squared minus three, and I've completed the square.